All right, guys, got one tickets here. As you guys can see, there's a bunch of glass just about everywhere. Yeah, buddy. Got bracing. But essentially, right now, we're strengthening the floor of the vehicle. Um, it's a northern car, so there's rust, obviously. So it's just kind of a precaution. Um, though I would totally recommend that anyone does this when they build a wall, because the floor of your vehicle was not designed to carry as much weight as you're about to put in it. So you make it a little stronger. Ain't no thing. Well, we have a ton of glass in here. Um, show them what we got over there. And as you guys have seen in the other video, we have a ton of glass. That is a ton. There's another two gallons right there. We got another ten right there. We have some hardener and so we we are getting ready here to get this thing ready so that we could have the wall in here. So let uh, Mr. John continue. the battery, the entire battery rack with six group 31s so is all going to go across this area. So that's why we're making sure it's uh, up to the task, so to speak. Yeah, and those is group 31s. Hold on one second. Let me show you this. These are things are absolutely sick. You got them at a stupid, stupid low deal. There's four there. There's one there, and there's one inside of this box. I am too lazy to take one out, and because they're really heavy in the first place. Well, so let's open just to show you that you have room there, right Hardware. So. All right, we're gonna continue glassing throughout the day. We're gonna then build a false floor back there, where as you guys can see, we zoom in here a little bit, we're going to build a false floor back here, spray foam, 2 by 4s and then we're going to start actually building the shelf on top of that. So we got everything ready, and let Jack continue fiberglassing, and we'll get another video in a little bit.